In this short video, we will go over how to set up a Taylor Studio Dwelling System CDM series controller. Having set up the controller in an appropriate location and connected it to a suitable mains supply, connect the welding earth cable to the controller, insert the plug and twist until it locks. Next, connect the welding pistol. Again, twist the welding plug until it locks. The control plug is keyed for insertion and has an external locking ring. Switch on the controller using the rear switch. The controller will start up and charge to the last use setting. Using the adjuster knob, adjust the displayed voltage to your required setting. The next stage is to set up the pistols for welding. We will go over how to convert a CD-C2 pistol from a standard setup to an extended leg arrangement for welding CD nails. Taking a standard CD-C2 pistol Remove the front end cap assembly and replace it with the front end cap from the extended leg assembly. Fit a CD nail chuck into the pistol. Insert the chuck backstop first into the lock nut on the pistol and press the chuck fully home and secure in position using the chuck key provided. Once the chuck is fitted, slide the legs into the pistol and slide them all the way back. Take the nail stud to be welded and insert it through the guide in the foot adapter and fully home into the chuck. Slide the legs forward until the welding tip of the stud is just clear of the nail guide, leaving a gap of approximately 3 to 5 mm between the back of the nail flange and the leading edge of the nail guide. Once in this position, secure the legs with the screws in the front end cap assembly. Finally, check or set the pistol spring pressure using the rear end cap adjuster on the pistol. For this example we are setting the pistol to setting 2. The pistol is now ready to weld. This video is brought to you by Taylor Stud Welding Systems Limited. Thanks for watching.